Hey everyone, welcome back to What I Learned in Tech this week, week 10, I believe. Um, this week, I think the biggest thing that I learned, and, and maybe not even just this week, but in the last couple of weeks has been the memory shortage. Just wanted to bring it to attention because <clears throat> everybody is feeling it, especially in tech or anybody that's looking to build a PC, a gaming PC, you know, home lab, whatever. It doesn't seem to matter. Anything that uses memory, um, those prices have gone drastically up. Um, anywhere from two to four times in the last, you know, three months. So really seemed like it kind of started in, in September-ish, late September, early October, when things were on the rise. And I built a gaming PC on the channel uh, at the end of September, I believe it was. And I paid $88 for a 32 gigabyte stick or uh, set of um, DDR5 memory. And that same set or comparable set today is nearly $400. So that's a four times increase in price, uh, which is just, you know, in insanity, pure insanity. So the question is, is what's driving this increase? And, and as you're likely aware, it's all the AI data center build out. So they just need all that memory capacity to build out those data centers. So, you know, Micron, SK Hynix, um, Samsung, all of those manufacturers that are making memory chips have committed most, if not all of their cap uh, capacity to co produce those memory chips to building HBM memory for uh, data center AI build outs. So it's just a big, big issue right now. And, and uh, you know, Micron has killed its, its brand. It's a consumer brand crucial. However, where does that leave us right now? The, the other thing is, is the used market is pure insanity as well right now. So I've seen even people trying to sell DDR3 memory, which was phased out in 2015, that's 10 years ago. I still am start now starting to see people trying to sell DDR3 memory. So um, if for some reason you need memory, it's gonna take a little bit longer for you to find a good deal. The deals can still be had. Um, you know, It's much like the GPU issues over the last five years, ever since COVID, where getting a GPU has been extremely difficult. You may pay a little over MSRP, but you know, hold on, um, check secondhand lo locations, eBay, Reddit hardware swap. And I've seen Marketplace lately, not as bad. Um, you can still find deals on Marketplace just because a lot of people not in tech aren't aware of the issue right now. So you can still get some deals, but that's what I learned this week in tech. Um, let me know what you learned in the comments and uh, we'll see you next week.